Kel Cab back with another video. Just uh, got done with my shift. I didn't make much money today, but I'll be back out tomorrow to make up for what I lost today. It was my fault, man. I did some stupid stuff. But anyway, um, just wanted to get to the topic of the video. I know a lot of you guys are, you know, waiting for the topic to appear in the video, so, my thing is, a lot of men have to start taking life more seriously, especially nowadays, I mean, you think about it, with all this gentrification, and all this technology, shit like that, man, that shit is making our life a lot worse, it's not making us a lot better, you know, as men, at all, you know what I mean? I mean, technology, yeah, you can use it, but it's also very harmful, you know, especially to these wannabe Instagram model chicks that go around, like, showing their ass off to the public, looking for attention and shit like that, man, you know what I mean? Like, that's not making things better, it is, it's making these women look like a fucking complete Instagram thought, you know what I mean? Gotta start taking more, start taking life more seriously, man, because there's a lot of niggas out here that are not getting laid. The competition has gotten a lot more fierce for pussy nowadays. You got gentrification. If you look at the fucking world, the way, uh, if you live in these areas, you know, around gentrification, you are being closed in by rich people. That don't give a fuck about your well-being. It's getting a lot more expensive. Especially here in California. It's getting a lot more expensive here. And it's going to get even more expensive. You know what I mean? So. You got to start taking life more seriously. Save your money. You know what I mean? And somehow become successful in the, in the, in the end, man. Because. Um, we don't know what the future holds, man. You know what I mean? We don't know if, you know, if, if this is going to be a fucking all-rich, you know, uh, country. Because I don't know what they're doing with the gentrification thing, man. I mean, I feel like that I'm being closed in, like... Fucking, these rich white people are closing in on us. You know what I mean? And, you know, that's one, that's one of the reasons why I stopped drinking. Because I wanted a little bit more money in my pocket. Because things are so expensive that I got tired of being short a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So, and then ever since I stopped drinking, it, ha it has made a difference. In my pockets. Um, gentrification. We getting our neighborhoods taken away from us. Uh, affordable housing is no longer available. You know what I mean? You can't get anything under $1,500 nowadays. You know what I mean? Rent is outrageously fucking expensive. Especially here in California. And... You know, uh, life is getting a lot more tough as I age, so that's why I'm like, okay, I need to be a certain place in about five or ten years from now. Um, I can see that I'm not getting laid out here in California like I used to, or I'm not getting hit on like I used to, and I realized that because there were a lot of women that came out of, out of fucking, um, um, out of town out of state, they coming from different areas and stuff like that, man, so, you know, and not only that, it's just, it's Instagram shit, man, you know what I mean, I haven't had sex in a while, it's by choice, I could get online and find me a little thought or something like that, man, but I choose not to, but I also noticed that the, it's, it's a lot different than it, when it was 10 years ago, you know what I mean? The competition, like I said, for money, pussy, and resources has gotten a lot more fierce. And it's nothing to be 
laughed at or you, there's no, it's nothing to take lightly. I mean, this is real serious shit out here, man. These nerds are making it a lot harder for us to live. You know what I mean? So, we gotta start taking life a lot more seriously, man. Like, I, I, I can't even find a way to laugh nowadays. I mean, I might find something funny, like if I watch my show, The Boondocks or something like that. You know what I mean? Watch some old ass episodes or whatever. That makes me a lot. Feels, I mean, that 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 makes me laugh. You know what I mean? It gives me a few chuckles. Then it's back to reality. You know what I mean? I don't laugh on a daily basis like I used to. It's just shit ain't funny, man. You know, the way these females are acting, you know what I mean? Being all fucking sh- shady and fucking shallow and shit like that. Shit is not funny. That's why I quit alcohol, man. Alcohol was bringing me down. Even if, when I was drinking once a week, it was bringing me down. Basically, I would drink that day and be sobering up the next day. Getting older, getting too old, I need to chill, you know what I mean, and take life more seriously, man. This is not a game out here. Your enemy is not playing with you. They don't want you to have resources or any type of success in your life. They want you to stay poor and beat down and taking sloppy seconds from other races, including your own. Unsuccessful men are going to be dating and fucking single mothers, man, for the rest of their lives, man. That's just the way it is. If you don't learn any type of discipline, you're going to be fucking fat bitches, uh, single mothers. That's just what what you're going to be feeding off on for the rest of your life because, you know, if you ain't got no ambition, no dreams or whatever, and... You're trying to get laid on a regular basis. For example, if you don't got no, if you ain't got no ambition, you ain't got no, no dreams or nothing. You're an average guy that's under six feet tall. You're gonna have a hard fucking time your whole entire life. That's why I say maybe we should all just go ahead and go after our dreams. So that way, this single mother bullshit that we gotta fuck on the date. You know what I mean? Like if if I'm active with women. I feel like that's all that's available to me when I'm active. You know what I'm saying? I'm not active now, but I feel like that's what's uh, that's what what's available. That's what's coming my way. These trashy, stomped down, you know, ran through women, and then so you're not a fat, you're not a faggot. You're gonna fuck them, but you're not gonna date them. You know what I'm saying? It's a different. It's, there's, there's a different. There's a difference between fucking behind closed doors. And dating these bitches out in the open and spending money on these hoes. You know what I'm saying? I bring over a six pack and some wings. And when we can fuck, or I could bring over, if she's an Asian bitch, I bring over some six pack. I bring a six pack, or, or not even a six pack, like a fucking, like, like UV vodka or something like that, corner store vodka, $7 bottle. And go, go get some pho, that costs 20, 20 bucks. And you spend $27. And have a good night. You know what I'm saying? That's what I used to do with the other bitch. You know what I mean? But I feel like that's going to be my life, my whole entire life, if I don't start getting disciplined. That's why I let go of the alcohol. Alcohol is making me look old, drying my skin out, even worse. I'm already getting older. I don't need to look older because of the alcohol. You know what I mean? So... um. This is not a game out here. And I'm pissed off, man. I'm pissed off. And you think, you know what I mean? Every time I see these fucking tech guys out here, I feel like I want to choke their fucking asses. Because they're making everything so expensive and making it hard to live. And making the the, the, the uh, competition for pussy, getting the, you know, making it even sh- stronger. Making a competition even stronger out here. You know what I mean? So. Not a game. They're making it really hard for us to live. And that's why I'm thinking about moving away from California completely. I'm pretty much done. 
You guys have a good night. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a like and a comment. Click the notification bell button so you will never, ever miss another video from me. And I'm out.